And just as the candidates are in the spotlight tonight, so is the CU campus. And students and staff, they're hoping their campus shines on this gorgeous Colorado day. 7 News reporter Mark Boyle is live on the CU campus. It's a busy, busy place today, Mark. They have been very busy all over campus. In fact, a ballroom over at the student union, and they've been setting up all day for hundreds of students to watch this debate tonight. Here at Fair and Field, they've been setting up as well. You can see a Latino rally underway right now. They want my vote, my voice, and that's going to be a big uh, theme as we head through the elections. The excitement here really building, and that is they're trying to get Latino voters out to the polls in November. They also, though, people like Federico Pena driving some of this, they want who? to get the Latino community in the main Please stage here when they're talking about immigration reform and they want to steer some of that dialogue in a different direction. Latino community. You cannot launch hateful rhetoric against a particular group. In this case, it's immigrants and Latinos. We're better than that. So we're going to speak out against that today and correct the record. Are you ready? Federico Pena speaking right now to the crowd here, and certainly this Let's is nothing shy of a party at this point, but that's what so they want. This is a nonpartisan like gathering today. They don't care who people are voting for as long as the Latino the community is, in fact, getting out to the polls. Live in Farron Field on CU's campus, Mark Boyle, 7 News. Guys.